Hello, YouTubers. This is for those of you who have a Dell computer with a Sigmatel sound card that does not, which, if you notice, watch this. Recording devices. Damn it, my battery's low. What do you get? Microphone. Array microphone, which is the built-in one. Hmm, some of you might want wave out. Think you can do this. Show disabled devices. Oh, it's already checked. If you want wave out, but your sound card does not support it. Hmm. You're probably thinking, I'm screwed, I can't use wave out. Well. Here's what you do if you want wave out. Go to Staples. And buy this. Oops. Go to Staples and buy something like this. I just bought this at Staples. It's a Belkin mini stereo audio cable. And this is it. How do you use this as wave out? Well, you see this? Plug it into the microphone. It doesn't matter what end you plug into the microphone. Take this end, and th this comes up. You're gonna click line in. Take this part, or it doesn't matter what end you do because they're both the exact same. Plug it into your headphones. To use wave out. Now, the thing is, you're gonna have to cue your vi YouTube video, or Whatever you want to you record to the part that you want because unfortunately you cannot hear it. So you either want to go to sound recorder and click start recording. But first before you do that you might want to do this. Recording devices. Make sure you have this set. You can either... You're just doing a generic thing. Just go to sound recorder. You just want to simply just record it. Click on start recording. And then it starts recording whatever you want to play. Stop recording. Save the file, whatever you want to do. Or go to... No, I do not want to save. Or you want to do some more high tech thing, different effects. Download a DOS. Go to audacity.com and download this. Watch this. Now, see, this is a microphone. Watch this. Let's open up a video. Start recording, and, and you might want to adjust the volume here because it does tend to be pretty loud, so you do this for whatever you want to record it with, doesn't matter. Alright, just stop and you're done. Then to play it back, and hook it, go to the video, press play. Do what you will. Now you see. Just saying you can do it on Dacity, just you can you select it all. You can do something like this. Watch this. You can change the speed. You could go faster. You can do reverse. You ready to go? My battery's low, so bye. This cable. Can also be used to 
transfer tapes to a C CDs. Here is an example of something. This is the McDonald's tape. I transferred it using this cable by connecting this into the headphone jack and the other end into the computer's microphone jack and use that same program I did for the wave out. Actually, while we wait for that to load, I'm going to show you what I did. See? Be a tape, and now it's a CD. The entire plan, I don't think about the entire plan. Used to be this. <clears throat> Let me get that. What you do, go to audio, convert LPs and tapes. Watch this. This is what I use to convert my tapes to CDs. Now, of course, the stuff on the tape is still going to be on the tape. It's not going to erase. And there it is. You plug it in. Then when you plug in the other thing, you press this down arrow. And you'll get another option that says line in or something like that. But as you can tell, whenever it gets sound in, that thing moves. And it's doing that because it's plugged into the microphone right now. Let's do a demonstration. Testing, testing. One, two, three. Testing. Now say, you're going to do that, and you press stop at every track. Just have to wait. And there it is. Track one. You know, you want to record a bunch of tracks, you record, you press stop at every track. Then you're ready to quit that track, press stop. You can make as many as you want, I guess. It's up to CD limits. And watch this, you don't want one, just simply press delete and then you can go to here you can delete the parts you don't like you can clean it by testing testing one two three testing get a noise or whatever so do whatever you want go to next click burn a CD put blank CD in here Burn it. Press finish. Finish, and it's gonna say this because I didn't burn a CD, so that's what you get. And that's what? Just buy this. The Belkin mini mini stereo audio cable. Speaking of Belkin, I'm connected to the internet using a Belkin router. That would be this router right here. Belkin. It's a very nice one, too.